Experts in Germany have uncovered a deciphered manuscript that has been determined to be the oldest record of Jesus Christ's childhood. The 1,600-year-old document had been stored in a university library in Hamburg, Germany, for decades. It was ignored until researchers from Germany's Institute for Christianity and Antiquity at Humboldt University in Berlin and Professor Gabriel Noki Macedo from Belgium's University of Liège closely examined the fragment and revealed it as the earliest surviving copy of the Infancy Gospel of Thomas, a document detailing Jesus Christ's childhood. The two experts said in a recent news release that the papyrus contains anecdotes not found in the Bible, but one that would have been available and shared during the Middle Ages. The words on the document reveal a remarkable miracle Jesus performed as a child, where he brought clay figures of birds to life. In the Gospel of Thomas story, a five-year-old Jesus is playing in a stream while molding 12 sparrows out of soft clay in the riverbed mud. But when his father Joseph sees what he is doing, he scolds Jesus and demands to know why he is molding clay on the Sabbath. Jesus responds by telling the clay figures to take flight as living birds, and they obey his command. According to the researchers, the papyrus was written in Greek. It contains 13 lines in Greek letters and originates from late antique Egypt. The papyrus was neglected for so long because past researchers considered it insignificant. However, new technology enabled the two men to translate the language on the document and compare it to other early Christian texts. It was thought to be part of an everyday document, such as a private letter or a shopping list, because the handwriting seemed so clumsy. Researchers explained that they first noticed the word Jesus in the text. Then, by comparing it with numerous other digitized papyri, they painstakingly deciphered it letter by letter and quickly realized that it was not an everyday document. The experts speculated that the story of Jesus' miracle was written as part of a writing exercise in a school or monastery. This is due to the awkward handwriting and inconsistent lines in the 1600-year-old papyrus. Unfortunately, there is no further information regarding the location or date the papyrus was discovered. Researchers will be producing a commentary on the manuscript. They will also readdress the style and language of the Gospel of Thomas text. The results will be published in the Journal of Papyrology and Epigraphy. We will follow the story closely and provide any updates to this fascinating historical discovery.